I was still, still rolling. He didn't have any power. He don't have any power, to be honest with you. I asked you after the fight how he would get on with someone like an Anthony Joshua or, or Tyson Fury, etc. Um, you didn't really answer that. What do you think about that now? How does he get on with those kind of guys? Don't eat him up. AJ, AJ alone will eat him up. Tyson will eat him up. He hasn't got power. He runs away a lot. Now he's boxing guys are six foot six there. How's he going to get there? He can't get there. They'll eat him up. The East style of boxing, he's not made for the heavyweight. That's why most cruiserweights can't make it up there. It'd be, it'd be hard for him. I went to him. You know, if, if I didn't go to him, that would be a stinky fight. You know, I went to him. If there was another heavyweight, it would have been a boring fight. All the way through the camp and the build-up, yourself and David said that you are in the best shape possible, the camp's gone perfectly, everything was right. So now the fight has happened, you still preserve that you did everything you could have done in the build-up and in, in, in camp? Yeah, man, listen, I say to this, I, if I didn't knock this dude out, I'm not going to win. I trained hard. Um, he was moving a lot. You know, I did hear my, my whole my whole point was destroy the body so we can slow his movement. But he kept on moving. But we kept on tagging him. You know, he kept on moving. You know, I knew after twelve rounds, they won't give it to me. I'm away. But did I enjoy the fight? Yes, I enjoyed it. I was fit. I was ready to rock and roll. I'd have done more rounds afterwards. Is it all about getting that out of your system now and just moving forward to whatever it is that is next? Yeah. But, you know, for him to, for Yusik to fight AJ, it's one side. AJ will walk through him because AJ's tall. He'll use his longer jab. Be a good fight, but AJ will win it by a knockout.